just uh, you're getting close. Yeah. You're about a week away. Just uh, how do you feel like your impression has been either altered or developed with the teams around the league once they've gotten to see you up close? I guess beginning mm. with the comp. Um, you know, I've always been the, the underdog, the one that's uh, kind of like in the mix but not really looked at, and uh, I enjoy that. So I just go to these workouts and just continue to play my game. I don't try and do too much, do anything out of my element, and let my game speak for itself. So the fact that this is all happening is a, it's a blessing, but um, this is only the beginning. So just got to keep working with these guys. Are you aware that it seems like the buzz around you in this draft is sort of exceeding and it's getting, it's sort of building up in mm-hmm. Christian going to maybe could go in the lottery or you could go somewhere else in the draft. Have you taken account of that or just uh, know that you are getting more buzz as this uh, process goes yeah, on? Yeah, you definitely hear it with social media. It's, it's, it's kind of like ignorant to say that you don't. You know, as you hear it, people tag you, your friends, family. My mom looks it up on Twitter every day. That, that's, what, that's what she does. She takes that. She takes my job of looking it up, but she does it for me. So um, I hear it. And, you know, the one thing I heard when I came out was second round. So that's pretty much the only thing that really sticks with me. Uh, second round, I don't. Uh, I just got my greener invitation, but like I still, you know, it's, it, I was excited. I, I probably screamed in my pillow for, for five minutes, but um, I still remember second round when it comes to these workouts. At the end of the day, you know, it, it's nice to have all that, but you got to just keep working. Like I said, this is just the beginning, so just continue playing like I can and let the buzz just deal with, have everybody else deal with the buzz, and let me just focus on the game. Did you uh, interview with the Panthers in Chicago? I don't think so. I could be wrong. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. With, um, with the fact that Buzz seems to be growing, with them at 18, what encouraged you to take this one? I've played here three times, and I love this city. You know, being right down the road. Um, I, I love everything about right Indiana. I worked out with Paul George about six or seven times this past summer in L.A. So um, I, I know the whole roster. I watched the games, watched them against the Cavs. You know, I, I, like I said, I've been up here and I had my, my kind of so-called breakout game in Baker's left field house. So I like that. Keep that same energy, keep that good karma. But um, I love it. Yeah, I love it out here. And a lot of people don't think know that when you, if you're not from this area, like have been around this area, you think what's well, in Indiana. But when you come here, you, you see that the fans are. That's all they care about is basketball. And I love that type of energy, not just from your team, but from the community itself and the coaches, obviously.